Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for whenever it resonates. We're just going to see what comes up. I want to thank everybody for the birthday wishes. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Um, yeah, I got a beautiful gift yesterday. A um, couple of them, as a matter of fact. So anyhow, uh, let's see what we got. What do we have for a message today? What do we have for a message today? Magician and the Knight of Cups reversed. So, hmm. It's a very masculine energy. Somebody that is very creative. The Knight of Cups reversed. Uh, could be somebody sweeping you off your feet. Hmm. This is taking action. And we do have an individual that is very skilled, very skilled in, in love by the looks of things because this is the Knight of Cups. And you notice those are the Two of Cups. Two of Cups is reversed. Uh, whatever, this is in reversed. Hmm. This guy is taking action in regards to a relationship. Probably not in love or not feeling love or not in a relationship. Okay, the Knight of Cups is in reversed. This magician is very masterful, very skilled, very able to, has a lot of resources within them. Hmm, this is a master of some sort. Interesting. Magician taking action. Golden opportunity here. Ooh. Oh my goodness gracious. Ten of Wands, so this person, we have, this is overwhelmed. Heavy load, got a very heavy load. Burdened. Page of Cups is emotionally immature, or could be, it could be very intense. There, or there, it could be, it could be a very emotional time. Hmm. This is bad news or not good news, unrequited love. We could have somebody here that is obsessed. They may have some, uh, they may be being insincere. What the fuck is going on? So I'm not sure if there's some sort of insincerity here. Burdened by something. Well, was that over, that was, uh, something was up with that. I don't know. But anyhow, we're going to put it right here. Knight of Wands. This is coming in fast. Moving very fast. Somebody here that is moving very fast into a relationship of some sort or something. This Knight of Cups reversed is... Well, this is, this is completely opposite right here. Act now, think later. Ta definitely taking action. So we definitely have an individual here that is moving very, very fast. I think it's into a relationship or something. Because the Knight of Cups is about it, or a relationship. So that is definitely moving very fast. Which is interesting. Now this is burdened, overwhelmed, trying hard. Trying very, very hard to do something. Hmm, maybe prove themselves. Ah, death reversed. Four of coins. I just want to get some more cards. Empress reversed. Five of cups. The tower. Oh boy. Gonna be an explosion of some sort. An explosion. Definitely not able to master emotions at all with the Knight of Cups reversed and the Page of Cups reversed. Somebody is not able to master their emotions. It could be a very emotional time. Something is happening very, very fast. Definitely. Definitely very fast. Um. There's some sort of grieving with the Five of Cups. I don't know if there's a loss here because of the Empress reversed and the Five of Cups. There's some, somebody may be grieving over a loss. You know? 
they're grieving over a loss. I'm not sure if it's a what kind of loss this is, but uh, the Empress in reverse. Uh, there could be some childhood issues here, or it could have something to do with a child or a mother. Um, not trying to to say anything, you know, something to do with a mother or a child with the Empress reversed. Uh, there's a lack of growth or we have an individual here that doesn't know their value. It could go so many ways. This is grieving and sad, but there, but you, but usually, I mean, this was a cup in this person's hand, usually with the five of cups, you know, there's three cups up here. This is a different five of cups. Okay. She's got a cup in her hand. So there's an opportunity for love. Okay. There's an opportunity for love here. There is after being in a situation that. Maybe there was a third party situation in the past or something. Something obviously has been shattered. Something has been shattered. Something's been, something has been broken. But there's still an opportunity for love. So yes, there's an opportunity for love here with this individual that is, you know, she may, she looks as though she's unsure. She's very unsure. It's like, hmm, I'm not sure if this is real. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if this is real. I'm not sure if I should take this. So we have an individual who's been socializing with somebody or whatnot because of the Three of Cups, maybe having some fun or whatever, and there's an opportunity for love, but looking down at the broken, looking down at what has been, what's, what the breakup, or looking down at what has happened, uh, looking, you know. So we got an individual here that is thinking about what has happened, a breakup, something that has broken, when they have, they still, they have an opportunity for love right in their hands. Um, now this is a sudden thing and it is very sudden. All three of these can be very sudden. Something, all of a sudden, something is happening all of a sudden. This is overwhelming and it could be worry. I'm not sure. It could be overwhelming worry or overwhelmed with whatever is happening so fast, not prepared for it. Definitely not prepared for a relationship or something like that. Death reversed, um... Next to the four of coins, this holding on is getting old. The, ho the holding on is getting old. Holding on to the past relationship that has... some some th Somebody is taking action because holding on to the unrequited love relationship has gotten, gotten old. It's gotten old. And now they're taking action. And we've been talking about this. Taking action to build a new foundation or something like that. With that tower, rever not reversed, it's upright. That tower card, that is, and it's a definitely a disruption. Somebody is dealing with some sort of, <clears throat> now the Empress reversed next to this Five of Cups. There's some sort of pain here. There is some sort of pain that hasn't been released yet. It hasn't been released. Hmm. There's an inter we have an individual here that is feeling an internal disruption because they have this new opportunity, but they're feeling distraught over it by the looks of things, you know. Somebody is coming in fast and there's and it's definitely overwhelming. It's it's over somebody is feeling overwhelmed over this. Um King of Coins. There's an individual that is very loyal and uh, dependable and responsible that is feeling uh, or knowing. This person is, is knowing that they have to take action by the looks of things. Now, holding on. Somebody wants to hold on to something. They don't want to let go with the death card reversed. Ten of pentacles reversed. Ten of pentacles reversed. That is short-lived success. Huge loss with the ten of pentacles reversed. False impressions with this card and this card. We have an individual that is putting out false impressions. They're not being real. 
what the hell is going on? There is definitely some false impressions here around an individual. Now, this the King of Pentacles is a person that is very interested in financial stability. And this is about stability and this is about stability. So there's a lack of financial stability. So somebody is, is they may be taking action to improve their financial stability. The Empress in reverse doesn't know her value or she's um, she may have low self-esteem poor self-image she may have a she have, may have a self-image problem and it's and the page of cups as well as a self-image problem so there's a, could have an individual here that has a self-image problem and doesn't know their value because they've been hurt so much in the past this is something coming in very very quickly but they may be being false with that Paid that Knight of Cups reverse. They come to sweep you off your feet. This is like a false relationship of something. They may be just looking out for, you know, some sort of financial gain with that Ten of Coins reversed. They may looking out for looking for a handout, looking for a payout. Hmm. They may have some tricks up their sleeve with the uh, Magician card. Interesting. What the hell is this? Page of coins reverse. This is a dead end. This is a player. Somebody is, is dealing with a player. I don't know if it's an earth sign, a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, or a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, or an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Okay. We have somebody here uh, that is not going to put in the effort to make something grow. They're not. They're not. They may be just looking for some sort of immediate payout, um, some sort of uh, finance, marrying for money or getting in a relationship just for the money or for the financial stability of it. Um, page of Pentacles reverse, lack of commitment. doesn't want responsibility. So we have an individual here that doesn't want responsibility. Very stubborn energy as well with that four of coins. Looking for, you know, I don't know. You know, that looks like it's, you know, something to do with money. You know, take it to the bank. Some, something to do with money. Looking for money. What the hell is this? Eight of Swords, Two of Coins. We have an individual here who's a fin financial mess. Two of Coins, Reverse. This guy is a financial mess. It could be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Okay? Um, financial mess. Doesn't, doesn't, uh, isn't very balanced. But this is being trapped. Mental turmoil. We have somebody here that is uh, comfortably numb, put it that way. Comfortably numb to the uh, situation, you know what I mean? And th these are facts. Swords are thoughts, they're facts. Truths. Comfortably numb to whatever situation they're in. It's like they've blocked out the truth. They don't, they, they, uh, aren't seeing what they can do to fix the situation, put it that way, other than let somebody else take care of them. Best thing to do is let this person take care of me. Interesting. So this is holding on. Somebody wants to hold on. Because they don't, and I don't know if there's, this is job related. It could be job related, but this is holding on to a situation, not wanting to be let go just for the money, which is, could be very well job related. Um, but it's not going, it's, it's short term success with the 10 of coins reversed. That's short term success. This is a false sense of security. 
The king of coins is somebody that is financially stable and solid and secure, typically. But that two of pentacles on top of it, this person may not be at this point. We could have somebody that is um, juggling. They're having a lot of losses in their life, a lot of financial losses. There could be a financial loss here, put it that way. Somebody could lose their job. Just saying. Um, because there's also a choice or a choice because twos are, twos are choices. So we have an individual here that is is probably struggling to make a choice. They may be in something that is very comfortable and they have to step outside of their comfort zone, but they're fearful. They're fearful of getting themselves in some any kind of false commitment. But that Knight of Wands is taking action again with a magician. This is an awakening, a wake up call with the magician. So somebody is about to, is willing, because the magician is willing to shed the old to bring in the new. So we do have an individual that is taking action to let go, because this is not, not give any more energy to an unrequited situ love situation that isn't stable. So that is definitely a change right here. So we have an individual that is taking action to probably build something stable, a new foundation with another individual. But there's definitely a feeling of whoever the other individual is, is probably unsure, probably very unsure of whether they are going to be taken advantage of or not. Whether this person will see their value or not. Um, hmm. What is this Empress Reverse? This Empress Reverse is an individual that is needy. She's needy. Uh, she might not know how beautiful she is, you know what I mean, or how valuable she is. Um, Ten of Cups. Ten of Cups. Something about a relationship. There's an opportunity for a lot of love here. There is. But I think there's a lack of trust. I do. I think that there is a lack of trust because there was a false foundation that was built in the past. Ten of Cups. Four of Wands reversed. So we do have a bond that is deepening or a relationship that could be stepping it up to the next level. But there's a, there's definite, I feel like there's a fear of, of, uh, it not being strong enough. You know, there's fear of it breaking down again. Now the four of wands reverse is lack of commitment. Somebody was or is in or building, this is a false sense of security where there's a lack of commitment. This is grieving over a loss, the five loss of a commitment. So we do have an individual here that is grieving over a, a loss of a commitment that didn't, you know, you notice the, you can't, there was no birth of it. It didn't get off the ground. You know what I mean? Things cracked, things cracked or they do crack. These eggs are going to crack. This is a crack. There's no birth. So it's, it's something going on with, uh, a crack. And this is being broken. This glass is broken. So something is could get... It's like a broken relationship here. A broken marriage. So we have a broken marriage, but there's an opportunity for love. So this is interesting. There's an opportunity to build a new foundation. If somebody takes action right now, right now with that Knight of, Co Knight of Wands, act now, think later, okay? Strength. Don't restrain yourself. Don't wait, okay? The strength card reversed is a lack of courage, a lack of confidence, um, fear, um, letting ego get in the way, letting pride get in the way of happiness. We have somebody here that... Maybe weak, maybe weak. We also have an individual that may be looking at somebody that is very vulnerable. And they may be, you know, they may have plans to 
you know, I don't know. Hopefully it's not use them because I see, I see somebody, um, It's almost like looking for somebody to save them. What is the overall message here? The message is, is that we have somebody coming in very, very fast. You may not be able to refrain yourself from this person or restrain yourself because there's obviously some sort of attraction. Um, but there's, there's a need to ground yourself because... And, and see it for what it really is because this person uh, may see you as weak or they may or vulnerable or something like that and they may be uh, coming forward just for uh, some sort of security you know financial security or something like that we have an individual that it he also he or she may be deciding to uh, let go of the old to bring in the new. They've been holding on to somebody in the past because of that holding on. The the magician is willing to let go of the old and then the death card reversed under there is holding on, not letting go. So somebody may be letting go now, deciding they're not going to go down that path anymore. It's an unrequited love situation. I don't want to be in it. They've held on as long as they can and they've been pretending that it was comfortable and they just decide to stop playing. They decide to let it go. They decide to get real. They decide to get practical. Okay, so, you know, I feel like that could certainly be the case. This is somebody who is definitely taking action. So there is going to be a change, put it that way. There's going to be a change in regards to a relationship. They could be with, we could have an individual here that has been with somebody who didn't take care of them because of the Empress Reverse. The Empress Reverse is a wife or a mother or somebody that doesn't take, didn't take very good care of them, didn't love them, you know, didn't nurture them, whatever. Um... And, and now there's an opportunity. There is an opportunity to be in a new relationship because there's one cup that is in this person's hand. But there's fearful of building another false sense of security or a false foundation. I think things are happening very, very fast and it's quite a shock. It's maybe uncomfortable. Okay, it may ca be causing an internal disruption or some sort of... What I wanted to say, I don't know, for, at some point was discombobulation. You know, it's just like, hmm, it's just, this feels kind of... Um, different you know building this up but um there is definitely an opportunity for extreme happiness with the ten of cups but it's after somebody gets out of some sort of uh false commitment that you know has probably broken up or broken apart a long time ago okay it's needing to uh accept it needing to accept that that's over and stepping into the new um relationship and trusting and i think there's a lot there's a lack of trust here um whoever you're dealing with is probably very loyal with that king of coins because the king of coins is typically very loyal very genuine very real this person um is looking for something solid and stable and secure and they're and they've learned something throughout their past okay they've learned something they've learned something about faults relationships and I think now they're really 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 looking for something solid stable and secure so that's what this is about I think we have an individual that is coming in fast that is looking for something solid um but it's it's kind of uh it's a shock for sure next to that tower card oh that one wants to come out three of cups reversed three of cups reversed that's this the competitiveness. This is termination of some sort. The, 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 the party is over. And this is the party is over as well. No chance of reunion with somebody. Somebody that didn't take care of them. There's no chance of reunion. Somebody has made up their mind. They have made up their mind that they are ready for a new relationship. And the person that didn't take care of them is experiencing a huge loss. That's what I got. Good luck.